Hi, in this video we'll learn how to find the equation of a line when given two points. So we know that the equation of a line in slope intercept form is y is equal to mx plus b. So for finding the equation of a line, we only need two things. The first one is the slope, which is m, and the second thing is the y intercept, which is b here. So for finding the slope, we'll use this formula m is equal to y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. Now we know that these, uh, I can write this point, these points as this coordinate is x and this one is y, and this is x and this is y. And I can label, I can also label them as x1, y1, x2, and y2. Now I will use these points to find the slope. So I'll write m is equal to y2 is 8, so I'll write 8 here, minus y1 is 5, and then x2 is negative 3, so I'll write negative 3. And x1 is 4. Then x2 minus x1 is 4. So here I'll get 8 minus 5 is going to be 3. And negative 3 minus 4 is going to be negative 7. So my slope is negative 3 over 7. Now uh, let's write the equation y is equal to mx plus b. So I know what my slope is. So I'll just uh, substitute the value of slope here. Negative 3 over 7x plus b. Our equation looks good. But uh, what uh, we are missing one thing. We don't know the y-intercept yet. So let's figure out what the, what the y-intercept is. Now, looking at these points, I mean, you, we can think that, you, you might think that this is the y-intercept. But remember that y-intercept is where the line crosses the y-axis and the x-coordinate at that point is 0. So neither of these points, neither of the x-coordinates are 0. So uh, neither of these points, I mean, these could be y-intercept. So to figure out what the y-intercept is, we can still use these points. So these points are on the line. That means these points will satisfy this equation. So we can use one point here. Let's use 4 and 5. 4 and 5 because we have both the values positive. So we'll use these points to find the, uh, what, the, what, the, what is the value of b. We'll use these points to find the value of b. So uh, let's substitute y, uh, x equals 4 and y equals 5. So y is equal to 5. And this is equal to negative 3 over 7. And then my x is 4. So I'll just substitute 4 here plus b. Now 5 is equal to negative 3 times, I can write this as 4 over 1. Now negative 3 times 4 is going to be negative 12. And then 7 times 1 will be 7 plus b. Now uh, uh, I need to find the value of b. So I can add both sides of the equation by 12 over 7. Adding both sides by 12 over 7. So these two cancel out each other. And then 5 plus 12 over 7. Well, I can write this as, uh, let's do it here, 5 plus 12 over 7 is equal to b. Now I can write this as 5 over 1 and since we have unlike denominators we can multiply this fraction by 7 over 7. Uh, 7 times 5 is going to be 35 and then 7 times 1 will be 7 plus 12 over 7 is equal to b. Now 35 plus 12 will be 42 divided by 7 is equal to b and 42 divided by 7 will be 6 so we can write that b is equal to 6. Now we have got the slope, we have got the y-intercept, we can just go ahead and plug in these values in the, this equation y is equal to mx plus b. So we can write that y is equal to uh, m is negative 3 over 7 and then I have x plus b so plus my b is 6 so this is my final equation. So this is how you find the equation of a line when given two points. That's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in next video.